Time, no place. They don't understand that these kids are gonna make some mistakes. So to you other kids all across the land, there's no need to argue. Parents just don't understand. <laughs> My mom took me school shopping. It was me, my brother, my mom, oh, my papa, and my little sister all hopped in the car. We headed downtown to the gallery mall. My mom started bugging with the clothes she chose. I didn't say nothing at first. I just turned up my nose. She said, what's wrong? The shirt cost $20. I said, mom, the shirt's flat with a butterfly collar. Next class hour was the same old thing. My mother buying me clothes from 1963. And then she lost her mind and did the ultimate. I asked her for Adidas and she bought me zips. I said, Mom, what are you doing? You're ruining my rep. She said, you're only 16. You don't have a rep yet. I said, Mom, let's put the two black coat. She said, no. You go to school to learn up for a fashion show. I said, Mom, this is a shine. Now, come on. I'm not a thousand. Mom, please put back a brave pattern. <laughs> But if you don't want to, I can live with that. But you got a foot back and tell them they're reversible slacks. She wasn't with it, everything stayed the same. Inevitably, the first day of school came. I thought I couldn't get over it. I tried to play sick, but my mama said, no, no, wait, uh-uh, forget it. There was nothing I could do. I tried to relax. I got dressed up in those ancient artifacts. And when I hopped in the school, it was just as I thought. The kids were cracking up, laughing at the clothes mom bought. Those who were laughing still had a ball because they were pointing and whispering as I walked up the hall. I got home and told my mom how my day went. She said, they were laughing, you don't need them because they're not good friends. For the next six hours, I tried to explain to my mom but I was going to have to go at least two or more times. So to you other kids all across the land, I need to argue parents who don't understand. <laughs> Situation. My parents went away on a week's vacation and they left the keys to the brand new Porsche. Would they mind? Mm, well, of course not. I'll just take it for a little spin and then maybe tow it off to a couple of friends. I'll just cruise it around the neighborhood. Well, maybe I shouldn't. Yeah, of course I should. Pay attention, here's the pick of the pot. I pulled up to the corner at the end of my block, and that's when I saw this beautiful girl with a go walk, and I picked up my golf ball to perpetrate like I was talking. Should have seen this girl's bodily dimensions. I hung my horn just to get her attention. She said, Is that for me? I said, Yeah. She said, Why? I said, Come on, take a ride with the hell of a guy. <laughs> Some deranged lunatic I said, come on, Toots My name is the prince Besides, will the lunatic have a Porsche like this? And she agreed and we were on our way And she was looking pretty good And so was I, I said, whoa We hit McDonald's Pulled into the drive We ordered two Big Macs And two large fries of coke Kicked the shoes off onto the floor And she said, turn the things me on. She put her hand on my knee, I put my foot on the gas, we almost got whiplash, I took off so fast, the sunroof was open, the music was hot, and this girl's hand was slowly moving up my thigh, she had opened up three buttons on her shirt so far, I guess that's why I didn't even notice that police car, the two of mine in my mom's new porch, and to make this long story short, short, when the cop pulled me over, I was scared as hell, I said I don't have a license, but I drive very well, officer, almost had a heart attack, that day, come to find out the girl, she was a 12 year old runaway. I was arrested, the car was impounded. There was no way for me to avoid being grounded. My parents had to come up a vacation to get me. I'd rather be in jail than to have my father's hit me. Parents walked in and I got my grip. I said, Oh, Mom, Dad, how was your trip? They didn't speak a said a word be my case, but my father just shoved me in the car on my face. It was a hard ride home. I don't know how I survived. They took turns. One would beat me while the other was grabbing. I can't believe it. I just made a mistake. Well, parents are the same. No matter time, no place. To so see you other kids all across the land. Take it from me. Parents just don't understand.